Hello, you guys. Welcome back to All Things Jennifer. I hope you guys are all doing well. I haven't been on here, and I want to say in about a month, a month and a half. But you guys know, if you have been watching my community posts, I post there that we were moving. So we get right into this video, y'all. Thank you to all my oldies, but goodies. Thank you to my new subscribers. Thank you guys. My name is Jennifer, by the way. Um, I see that I went up on uh, subscribers, I think about 15. I was kind of surprised you guys because I haven't been making videos. I'm sorry. I will make it up to you. I have a lot of things in store. So like I was saying, um, on my community post, uh, you guys, I posted uh, a moving truck and that we was leaving Georgia. We left Georgia. I've been talking about it in riddles for a while now, saying we was getting ready to move. Um, and it happened, and we are in beautiful Colorado. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. I cannot tell you guys enough how much I love Colorado. Um, we moved here. Uh, we've been here about three weeks, I think. So we haven't even been here a month, I think. Uh, and it may be two weeks. I'm not for sure. Um, but it's not a month. I do know that. Um, everything is going good here. I want to get on here and tell you guys what to look forward to on my channel. So you're going to be looking forward to, uh, fashion. Of course, I do not get away from fashion. I never will. It's in me, not on me. I love fashion. So it will be like, um, hauls, um, shoes uh all that jazz so i'm not going away from that uh, my business has been put on a hold i am coming back with my business i don't know if i will be bringing a lot of my business on here uh i will figure that out soon um i gotta get things situated um also we just started to get done with the house picture frames and all that stuff is up now so, I said, once I get done with that, I'll get on to chit-chat with you guys. We're watching the game right now, you guys. Um, the basketball game. But, um, it's going to be like fashion. It's going to be health and wellness. We are going... I wouldn't... I don't like labels. So, I will say we're going to um, be not eating like... Uh, basically, like pescatarian. So we'll be eating a whole lot of seafood or somewhat seafood, but not actually meat like your steaks, beef, all that pork, chicken. And we barely eat pork anyways. Um, so we're trying to move to a healthier situation, uh, making better choices. And we have a juicer. So you'll be on my, the journey with me of getting healthy, a better health, better wealth. Uh, you guys, I will show you the juicer. We'll be also making videos on what I'm juicing for the week. Stuff like that. Um, I would like to do a challenge once I get up there and start the learning. You know, the juices and stuff like that. So, I'm bringing a lot of different things. I did get messages from you guys because I did post it on Instagram about my juicer. And everybody was like, oh, I want in or... I want to know what type of juices you're going to make, stuff like that. And my husband is along for the ride. The girl, not so much. She's upset. She do not like all these different fruits and veggies. You guys, she's not big on certain uh, fruits anyway. She only got about maybe four uh, that she likes. So we're going to be doing that as well. I'm going to take you on um, Journey of Colorado where you'll see different things that's going on with Colorado you get to see, you know, um, I guess like the zoo, you know, stuff like that. Because we haven't been here, I think, since 2014. We was stationed here. Uh, back then, they wouldn't allow you to extend uh, in Colorado. Uh, so, you had to go to your next duty station. So, now, the Lord made it so we, this is home. Yeah, we're done moving. Um, so, you guys, basically, this video is to catch you up. And also, it wouldn't be me if I didn't show you something. 
So I have a new pair of shoes, of course. You guys, I have actually more than one pair. But the thing of it is, I didn't get the uh, the pair. So I probably uh, would do that in another video, okay? Um, but we are going to talk about these shoes only because uh, they're for the 4th of July. So I'm wearing, I'm going to wear them after that. But you guys, that's what I got them for. And it's, uh, if you do not know this brand, y'all need to go look it up. I wore these shoes uh, when I was younger in high school. Love the brand. So comfortable. Um, they were popping back in the 80s. Um, I mean, they came out in the 80s. What am I talking about, y'all? Popping like that. I was here for a long, long time. But anyways, uh, they came out in the 80s, I think like 1989 or, or something like that. And they are the Sakoni 5000. Shadow 5000, you guys. I love them so much. Uh, they ship pretty quick. They don't take long to come to you. I am an eight and a half in women's. I can't get into eights. It depends on the shoe, but I would like to do the eight and a half to be safe. So that's a seven in men. But here they go. You guys, everything got a match for me. So you'll get the gist. But here they are. They are red, white, and blue, you guys. So I have these uh, for the 4th of July. I have some red, white, and blue socks. I'm going to wear with these as well. Um, I love them so much. Uh, how detailed they are. Uh, here's the shoe screen to match. And look at that. So I'm going to, of course, get you the other shoe. It has the brown or tan rubber bottom. This color is not white, you guys. Right here is like an ivory color. This is the white mesh right here. Of course, this is the red. This is their, like, symbol or logo or whatever you want to call it. Uh, this is the red and white blue tongue. Like, it is popping a 4th uh, of July shoe. Uh, I had, I think the last time, my husband will tell you, he said every year I get a pair of 4th of July shoes. We was big on that, you guys. And then we um, started moving and stuff like that, started getting busy with life. We stopped probably the last past maybe three years or maybe three or four years. The last pair of 4th of July shoes I got, though, was the Kevin Durant's. Um, they're in there. Uh, I can't really fit them like I used to because uh, I think they're seven and a half. I'm not for sure. Seven and a half or eight. But Kevin Durant's shoes are kind of tight, okay? So I got these, and I love them. And they're called... Shadow 5000, but they got a name for the 4th of July, you guys. You can, it says white, red, um, and black, block, rogue, but they red, black, I mean, white, red, and blue. No, I got that on there. But anyways, here they are. You see that right there. So I'll link them as well. They did have a lot in stock. I guess because people are not really thinking about the 4th of July. And we're probably going to go uh, to the base for the 4th of the July. They always have a spectacular um, event on the 4th of July. So we're going to go there. We're not far from the base. Which I'm so happy to be back to it. Just because you have the PX. You have the commiss commissary if you guys know. Uh, and they make you save money y'all. And here is both of them. They are gorge. You guys, when I saw them, they sent me an email. Um, I was trying to get back into them when they came out with, I think they're called pandas. I think. So similar to the donks. They're black and white. And I signed up for their email, um, their mailing list. And once I did, now they send me out every time they come out with some shoes. And you guys, I had to cop these. I had to. And they were only 110, which you can't beat it. Because before, for my donks, I spent upwards. Because sometimes 
I don't get the shoe when it comes out. And if it gets too popular, you know how that goes. It's like Jordan's. So you're going to pay an arm and a leg. But now the Panda Dunks you can find anywhere. I actually don't even wear them out just because I do not like that everybody got them. I'm going to turn them into some lawn shoes or something. Uh, but these are amazing. And guess what, you guys? I got my girl a pair as well. Um, I'm going to get somebody else a pair as well. But I can't say it on here just in case. I don't know if she watched my videos, but... So I won't say it, but these are amazing, you guys. I did try them on already. I can fit them to a T. Um, if you are an eight, go an eight and a half. If you are a nine, go a nine and a half. So go a half size up, uh, cause they tend to. If your feet is not narrow, you're gonna need a little bit of extra room, especially if you plan on wearing socks. The man is over here, y'all. So that's why I looked over there. If y'all be like. Oh, what's she looking at? She's not giving us eye contact. My husband is over there. But, you guys, so that's what I bought. You guys, I bought another pair of shoes as well. Um, and uh, I won't show those probably until I get the bag that I'm looking for. Probably. I'm not for sure just yet. Um, I don't know what the next video is going to be. But I do know, you guys, I'm going to make the next video on Tuesday. So, you guys hold me to it because I'm going to do it, okay? Uh, I thank you guys so much for all your love and your support, you guys. But look at these. Like, they eat, need their own little video. They're fire. Y'all see that? They got the name on the back. Look at that. And then that rubber on the bottom. I wish this was, like, clear, though, instead of the tan color. But they got all colors, you guys. I'm going to... Link it below so y'all can check them out. It's a brand that hasn't been around for, oh my, for a long time, ever since the 80s. Uh, my mom got me hooked on them. I had almost every color when I was younger. Um, I think I'm going to go back to them and because um, the quality is is very, very good. I mean, I love that they're going different styles now. It wasn't as many styles when I was younger versus now so i think i'm gonna end up trying to collect <laughs> them which oh my goodness you guys i got a lot of sho shoes um but i thank you guys so much i hope you guys are doing great and i hope you have a fabulous fabulous afternoon until next time you guys y'all already know stay fabulous bye